We've been talking for a long time now about how good exercise can be for your mental health. What we really need to say is that it's not just vigorous aerobic exercise that improves your mental health, it's any kind of physical activity at all. That's really good news if you're depressed and anxious, as not too many depressed and anxious people are able to motivate themselves to exercise, but many will be able to put just a little more activity in their day. When you're thinking about increasing your physical activity to improve your psychological well-being, there are some important things to remember. Number one is that you won't keep doing it or even start doing it for that matter if you don't enjoy it. Choose something you like doing to ensure that you will be a little more motivated to do it and to continue to do it regularly. Secondly, don't start with a marathon. Start just by being a little bit more active than you are now, with a view to doing a little bit more later on. If you're doing absolutely nothing, try some stretches in the morning or walking to the letterbox to check the mail. Every little bit helps. Just plan to do a little bit more than you're doing now and do it regularly. Thirdly, be physically active with someone else for company if that helps you do it. It often makes the activity so much more enjoyable and you can hold each other to task. Make sure you write your plan down in detail, including the fallback position if something gets in the way. Don't forget to set a review date for the plan when you'll consider whether what you're doing is enough or you would like to do some more. Don't worry yet about whether it's improving your mental health or not. That will sneak up on you over time. Just try to enjoy the activity for its own sake. It's not a bad idea, before you do this with your patients, to try making an activity plan for yourself. <laughs>